Hey guys, hope everybody's doing good. I am here today to share with you my design team package for craft supplies for you for the month of November. And just a little side note, I'm still getting over being sick, so I apologize if I sound a little off. But besides that, um, I got a lot of new items from the shop this month that I'm pretty excited to share with you guys. So I'm just going to go ahead and get started. So the first thing I have, which is new to the shop, is the super cute trim. So it looks like that. It's really, really cute. And this is good for doing things like edging and stuff like that. And um, this comes in white, as you can see. But I can tell that this will take dye really easily. So, you know, you can always dye it to match what you are working on. But it's really cute. So I got a bunch of that. And then I got some more of this braid of trim. Now... I've got this several times. I really love working with this. Um, I tell you guys every time that this just adds a really nice finished edge to your project. And um, this does come in several colors. A lot of times I like to get the white just because, like I said, it takes color very well. And you could easily get it to um, take the color of whatever project that you're working on. Uh, but if you're someone who doesn't have dye or doesn't like doing that kind of stuff, this comes in several colors, so you can just, you know, get the colors that you need. But I really like this stuff a lot, so I got some more of that. Then I got some of these right here, and these are new. These are just little tiny little applique pieces. And you can see these would be good for, like, tucking into clusters. You can just kind of have them poking out of the side because um, they're you know a nice small size and they're really cute so they're like on this organza material so um, you get a bunch in the pack so got those then I got some of these blue flowers right here and these do come in other colors as well these are perfect, again, for just tucking into your flower clusters. Um, you can just, if you're working on a project and you need to give a spot, like a little pop of color, um, these are perfect for stuff like that too. That's usually what I use them for. Uh, but you can see they have like a couple layers of petals and then the little curl in the middle. So those are really cute. <clears throat> then I got this trim. And you guys know I love my Venice laces. I love working with those. So as you can see, this one, it's really pretty. And it has like this, kind of like a clover design. These little loops. And again, these take color very well. So it would be perfect for that. So I got some of that to play with. And this one I've had before one of my all-time favorites if you're a shabby girl you should definitely get some of this trim because it's just gorgeous and I love working with it it's super pretty um, a lot of times I like to cut this up again and, and have it picking out or sticking out of like you know your flower clusters and stuff or um, you know just using it and kind of layering it looks really cute so I got some of that. And then of course, my favorite. I love these um, paper flowers. And these are the two-tone pink. And these are probably my favorite flowers from the shop. I always get them in different colors. I always love adding them onto my projects. I think they just, they're so easy to work with and they add just like the perfect touch of what I'm looking for. So, I got some more of those. Okay, then I got this collar right here. And this is new to the shop. And um, this is different. As you can see, it has like a bunch of different pieces on it already. So, you could actually take this like as a whole piece 
and just make it into a bib necklace if you like wearing those kinds of things. Um, you could also add like some felt to the back to make it a little bit more sturdy if you wanted to turn it, um, turn it into a necklace. That would be really cute. Of course, you can cut it apart and use it just as pieces on projects. Um, but it does have all these really cool pieces attached to it. There's like a shell, um, some different color um, acrylic pieces, some metal pieces. So this is, you know, very unique and different. And it's a nice big size too. So I got that. And then the next thing I have here is also new. These are like small collars kind of. <clears throat> and this is the pink one. And um, you could use it, you know, whole on a project. Again, you could also cut it apart. You can kind of cut here and make flowers and then use the edge piece as some trim. You can layer it with some flowers. All kinds of different things you could do. It's really cute, as you can see. So you'll get two of those. Super pretty. So I got that. And I got some of these appliques. And there are, if you're an applique person, there are different ones in the shop. Um, I haven't worked with these ones before, so I decided to pick these. And as you can see, they're really pretty. They're kind of like a, an off-white, very light cream color. And they have these clear sequins and these pearls attached to them. Super pretty. And um, you'll get six of these. So, you know, there's plenty to add to your projects. They're super pretty. I love the way that they sparkle. I got those. Then I got these flowers, which are new as well. Let's see here. These um, are made with like, kind of like a Venice trim, I guess. And they are like a cream colored, off white. And it's like a rosebud made out of trim so i thought those are really cool very unique looking i hadn't really ever seen anything like these before so when i seen them in the shop i knew i wanted to um, try those out and work with them so you'll get six in a set really cute so i got those and then i also got these which are really nice size and there's two in a set and again they're like a collar and they have these um, iridescent there's clear iridescent sequins in the middle and then over here as well and they also have some of these beads and I'm not sure it's like just some stitching on organza makes the design but it's really cool and unique and these are new as well so when I saw them I knew I wanted to try to um, do something with them again you can even use one of these and make like a bib necklace I know those are really in right now so that would be really cute so if you get those you will receive two so you'll have a lot to work with so I got those, and then I got some more of these white flowers that I really like. So they come just like that. It's like a two layer. There's like a satiny layer and then an organza layer. And then these do have the pearls in the center. So as you can see, they're really pretty. And it just comes on a little bunch here. So I got those, and then the last thing I have here, and these are new to the shop as well, and of course I saw these and I thought they were so cute. They're these metal butterflies, and 
If you guys have been following me, you know that I love working with the metal butterflies from the shop. So um, I knew, I saw these and I knew that they were new and I definitely wanted a chance to work with them. As you can see, they're really pretty. And um, I knew I would have a lot of fun working with them. And I was thinking to, well, depending on what kind of project I'm working on, I was thinking of giving these a little coat of paint. Like if I want to do a shabby project, you can just add some paint to it and make it more shabby looking and a little bit more distressed. Um, like I said, just depending on the theme of the project you're going with, you can always, of course, leave them as is as well. And there is a little um, circle on the top, so you can always add this to a charm. Like if you want a chunky charm or um, like a necklace or something, that could easily be made into a really pretty necklace. So, I was really excited when I saw these and I knew I wanted to have a chance to work with them. So, you will you can see you'll get a bunch. So, I'm going to have a lot of fun working with those. So, that is everything I received in my design team package for the month of November. Um, like I said, make sure you guys go check out the shop. The link will be in the description box below. And I've mentioned it before, um, but she's going to start selling back in her Zibbit store and her um, Etsy store. I believe as of last time, I heard, she said that she's only having the parchment sets available, but I believe she's going to be adding more stuff to those. Um, so make sure you guys check those out. And... Keep an eye out for my projects that I will be making using all these awesome items. And I thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.